Alrighty, hello everyone, welcome back to The Last Express. Uh, when we last left off, uh, one, you couldn't hear me very well, so I boosted my mic. I apologize if I end up clipping it from time to time. Uh, unfortunately, the game doesn't have any volume levels, so all the volume has to be controlled post, so I have no idea how well this is going to go. Um, but yes, when last we left off, I was lost and I believe I will still be lost. Some kid was running around with a damn whistle, irritating the rest of the passengers. So we got to find out uh, what else we got to be doing here. Why? Okay, these are the two ladies that like me, I think. Uh, pardon me. Well, that kid is riding me out. Hey, where are you going? Oh, you guys are together? Pardon me. Monsieur, that is not your compartment. What makes you think is not my compartment? Bonsoir, monsieur. All right, you know what? I'm tired of that kid. All right, we are back to the green sleeping car. What is going on down here? Hello? Let me just run on down here and see what you were up to. Ah, uh, monsieur, excuse me. This compartment belongs to the gentleman in number four. What the hell is going on on this train? Excuse me, monsieur, but this is the last sleeping car. If you are looking for the dining car, it is two cars forward. I thought I'd just take a walk to the end of the train. There is another car after this one, isn't there? Yes, but it is a private car. Je suis désolé, monsieur. Je suis désolé, monsieur. How désolé are you? Get the hell out of here. All right, so I guess uh, we have no other leads to go on. Let's see if we can find some more stuff going on here. Wait, what's this? Uh, why are you sniffing it? What did I just find? Okay, that's a crazy W. Alright, maybe we have time to go and look at uh, what we were looking at before. When did I pick up matches? Right away, Mr. I... D I no, put them away. We don't want them. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Uh, I've come across something exceptional. What happened in your Cuba? Land Depart Orient Express, no. 7 p.m. Friday. You no, shut up. All right. So let's see what our buddy was doing. In the wake of uh, Sergeant Connell dead and Mr. Riley severely wounded. The fishing boat, blah, blah, blah. West coast of Brittany, blah, blah, blah. Uh, discovery, body. And anyone who might have seen... Okay, I don't, I don't know. I'm sure that's a, a, a good clue for us, but... Uh, what else is around? Wait, why am I looking down? Wait, what? I can actually do something here? So I do... What am I doing? Oh. Well, that's interesting. Okay, uh... Forget it. <laughs> Let's just get out of here. And we want to go back past the child. Bonsoir, monsieur. Yes. I understand. Where's the dog? Where is this conversation taking place? What is going on? The toy whistle is dead. What is... I don't... Whoa! Excusez-moi! Whoa! What the... 
Why is this so freaky? Excuse me. Alright, you're looking a bit smug with your stupid hat. Why don't I follow you? Excusez-moi, monsieur. Oh. What's the... Did you, oh, is he just smoking? I thought he was playing with something. Deuxième service. Deuxième service. Le dîner est servi dans le wagon restaurant. Dinner right. is served in the restaurant car. Deuxième so dinner's service. served again. These two are still eating. And we can't uh Okay, she's new. Mind if I join you? That's bold. Is it customary in America to be so forward? Mm, yes, it in is. In certain circles, it's not unheard of. I must have been moving in the wrong circles. No. I hope you find somewhere to sit. Oh, we got denied. Did you not see how perfect my hair was? Are you sure you don't want me to sit down with you? With your Pope hat? Ça sent mauvais. Assieds-toi, François. That kid needs to die. François, assieds-toi tranquillement. Tu es au restaurant maintenant avec des adultes et j'exige que tu te comportes. Tu viens de cette Claude, excuse-moi de s'asseoir convenablement. Claude, regardez dans la fenêtre, François. Are you sure? Do not remember me. My name is August Schmidt. But I do remember you. You say it was a Mrs. Louders in London. Shut up, kid! I have no idea what these two are saying. Violin concerto. How lovely of you to remember. And you were with an English woman. Was she your wife? Um. Uh, uh, yes. Um. That is. Uh, ah. Miss Wolf, may I present my colleague from America, Mr. Tyler Whitney? Her Whitney? Miss Anna Wolf. I, I'm sorry, I didn't catch the name. Tyler Whitney. Have we met before? I seem to remember hearing of a Mr. Whitney years ago in New York. You were trying to raise money to start a revolution in Cuba, isn't that right? I have... And it that wasn't me. kid needs to shut up, for real. Herr Whitney is well known as a champion of freedom and justice in countries other than his own. But please, don't oh, let us interrupt your dinner. Not at all, you're both very kind. One does get so bored on these long journeys. Good evening. Good evening. I so there was a bit of exposition. Woman, is she? And a brilliant performer. To look at her, you would never think she was Jewish. Oh, look at him. Until Munich, sir. What's it matter that she's Jewish? Okay, so that was extremely annoying. That kid would just not shut up. And I don't know if you guys could hear the conversation that was going on, although I was also talking at the same time. Um but yeah, like, that was really terrible. I can't talk to him, so let's go back in the dining car. Pour madame. They're still talking! Bien cuit pour le jeune homme. Et pour vous, monsieur. Merci. Ce n'est pas ce que je voulais. Mais si, c'est un steak. C'est exactement ce que tu as commandé. I don't. Yeah. Merci, monsieur. Bon appétit. Je suis allé tout au bout du train. Et I must also vu. apologize, um... Excusez-moi, monsieur. Pardon me. What the hell? Non, monsieur. Uh, for the last video, I was indicating with the mouse cursor, but um, when the mouse is not one of these um, predetermined. Who is it? Conductor to make up your bed for the night, madame. Oh, I'll make your bed for the night, madame. <laughs> oh, wow, they are flirty. Oh, boy. Can I get in on this? It's the conductor, madame. What? It's the conductor, madame. It's the conductor, madame. Excuse me, monsieur. Pardon me. Wow, you don't last long, do you? Uh, but yes, what I was saying was I was indicating with the mouse cursor, and uh, when it's not a predetermined one. Okay, that's where the dog is. Screw that. Uh, pardon me. It's the conductor to make your bed, madame. Well, we found something. Oh. Not bad. Um, yes, so the cursor doesn't map. Wow, it's taking me a long time to get that out of my my head, eh? And uh, yeah, so I won't be using that excusez -moi, as a- Excusez-moi, monsieur. Ah, monsieur Whitney, excusez-moi. His Excellency wishes to receive you in his private car. 
What? Mm, His Excellency. Yes, Monsieur. He's waiting for you. Who? Where? Uh, but yes, the mouse cursor won't be using it anymore, so that that's all I wanted to say. So yes. I apologize. Sorry, these doors all look alike. My mistake. Where is this guy? Me and Anna. Mahmoud. Uh, sorry. Wrong door. Well, that wasn't creepy whatsoever. What? Who, where's his excellency? Monsieur, please. Me? The ladies yeah. do not like to be disturbed. Well, then tell me where he, the, his excellency Monsieur, is. Monsieur, please. The gentleman in number four. Hey. He will be very Let upset. Because I'm knocking on six? Tyler Yasemilos. What's your name? Yeah? Sorry. I can't keep these doors straight. Okay, uh, who is His Excellency and where am I supposed to find him? Excuse me. Okay. Yeah, shut up. Wait, wait. Damn it. I'm lost now. Did I check I? E? Why am I going so far? Whoa! Stop! Move! Whoa! What just happened? You make it all sound so simple. If you only knew how very difficult it was for me to get on this train. What the hell? Yes? Who is it? Sorry. Okay, um... I've knocked on every door. And, uh, I have not found His Excellency. Conductor, to make up your bed for the night, Monsieur. Ein Moment, bitte. Bitte kommen Sie rein. Oh. So our buddy is in room three. Who is it? Sorry. Pardon me. Okay. So while he's gone, actually, let's uh go sneak around because screw His Excellency, right? Hello. Oh. It seems I've been sent for by someone named His Excellency. That wouldn't be you, would it? Okay. Well, that would have made much more sense if you had just said, please come to the end of the... Wow. Sweet digs. Alright, let's, um, at least... What an unexpected pleasure, Mr. Robert Cat. Usually people call me Tyler Whitney. You should take care when choosing a name for yourself. Names oh. have power. The most primitive cultures understood this, but of course it will be as you prefer. Not everyone has the luxury of choosing his own name, Mr. Kronos. Whether you are Kath or Whitney is a matter of indifference to me. I am prepared to continue the discussions begun by my agent in Paris, provided that you have the piece of which you spoke. Is Kronos, your first name or your last name? I have no time to continue these delightful discussions of names. <laughs> I have brought with me a rather heavy briefcase. I would like to know now if the proposed exchange interests you and if you are capable of completing it. Not just at the moment, but I have hopes of being able to do so. In that case, we have nothing further to discuss. 
I myself must leave the train in Vienna. In case we do not see each other again, I wish you a pleasant journey to Istanbul and continued success in evading the British and French authorities. Have a pleasant evening, Mr. Ka. Kahina will show you out. Kahina? What just happened? I, they're, they're talking about deals that I don't remember making. Like, what the... What? I, I, I don't... What? Tell me, someone, am I missing some key moments in this game and that the game's just assuming that I've seen them? Alright, we're going to Epernay. Yeah, you better salute me, bitch. Pardon me? Uh, okay, I am so lost. I have no idea what's going on. Apparently that guy... Okay, you just came from a room and you're going into another room? That's fucking kid. Excuse me, I think oh. you dropped this. It's not mine. Isn't that your monogram? W. For Wolf. No. My mistake. Yeah, my mistake. Yeah, I hope you smack that kid, man. Excuse me, madame. Excuse me, monsieur. Excuse me, monsieur. Excuse me, monsieur. Yeah, I'm just walking faster than you. Alright, uh. There was a hat. Okay, now I can't pick it up. He took it with him. We ladies are up late. These aren't new ones, Sophie. All of Russia may go into revolt. <sighs> After a month on the island, you won't think about such things. Who's this? Listen. Why don't you write a play when we get there? Plus fine, plus fine, étrange lady. Débouché au dur de la feuille. Pardon, désolé, il n'y a que des carottes. Espèce d'incapable. Oh. Même les choses les plus simples sont trop dures à comprendre pour ta petite tête. Oh, excuse-moi, monsieur. Je te prie, s'il vous monsieur. Good evening, monsieur. We're allowed to uh, visit the kitchen, I guess. Des carottes. Alors tu penses être meilleur que le chef? This guy. All right, we're in the baggage car. I don't. I don't know if I could have got here earlier. I certainly didn't try. Monsieur, the baggage car is off limits. Please return to the dining car. Uh, okay, so we made it to chapter two. I don't know what's going on. You've boldly taken on your dead friend Tyler's identity to unmask his murderer and evade the police. Don't count on sleeping well tonight. I won't, sir. I won't. Because I'm way too confused and who's going to rest early or easy that way? But, uh, yes. Yes! Let's, uh, just call it <laughs> the end of the video here. Because I really have no idea what's going on. So, uh, yes, next time we uh, return, we will continue with Chapter 2. And hopefully uh, I've got the sound dialed in. If I don't, I apologize in advance. And uh, we'll see what happens. Cheers.